Hello guys, I hope everyone's well. John from the Wellness Suite here. I thought I'd pop in a little video, should be no longer than five minutes long. Um, just a little bit of added value for you guys, a little bit of education. And what we're gonna be talking about is alcohol versus fat loss. So I deal with a number of clients on a daily and weekly basis who wanna hit some health goals. The majority of them wanna lose body fat. So in terms of how we track body fat, I'll get them on my body composition scales, look at their body fat, and then each week we'll, we'll get them on the scales again and see where the body fat's going. Some people it might go up, it might stay the same, and it might even decrease, but they want to see it decrease a, a lot quicker. So after we've got all the stats down, we'll literally talk about, right, okay, how's your, how's your days been? How's your weekends been? Because obviously weekends can differ from a weekday. Um, people tend to get out of a routine on a weekend. Maybe there's a party to go to. So we're talking about alcohol versus, versus fat loss. So the majority of people I speak to, they get to a Friday night, they get to a Saturday night and they think, oh yeah, I'm, I'm popping out, I'm gonna have a few drinks or maybe have a few drinks indoors. I know the Euros is on, so um, the, the blokes are having a, a few beers. So just to give you some education around that. Effectively, the bottom line is, is if you drink, it's gonna stop your fat loss for that period and probably the period um, in, in time. So I'm, I'm not saying don't drink at all, but I'm just, this is just a little added value uh, message for you so you, you can get an understanding of what alcohol actually does to the body and how it inhibits fat loss. So for example, um, if we take beer to start off with, in beer you're looking at around about three units, which equates to around about 180 calories. They're not nutritional calories, you don't get no nutrients from them calories um, and you may hear them heard as um, empty calories. So wine, for example, for the ladies, um, or, or the men, I know you know, like a couple of glasses of wine every now and then, that's around about 220 calories. You're looking at about three to four units. Um, at the end of the day, this is all gonna be top line. I'm not gonna bore you with any science. So just to, to break that down um, and how the body utilizes um, and breaks down the, the alcohol when you, when you drink. So the liver basically is where your metabolism takes place um, and roughly about one unit per hour your liver um, metabolizes, metabolizes the alcohol. So for example, if you have one beer, um, which is three units, it's gonna take your body Three, around about three hours to burn off that beer um, in terms of the calories that it's just had. So you might think, oh, three hours, that ain't, that ain't too bad, but how does that affect your, your body fat loss? So basically what that does is, and I'll give you a scenario, I love a scenario. If you're going to a club, um, it's quite harmonic, and there's a queue for the club, so you, you stand, in the, stand in the queue and you're waiting to go in. So literally, you're all lined up, waiting to go into the club. Then all of a sudden, a load of people come along, they're in, they're, they've been on the guest list, um, so they go in first before you. So effectively, you waiting for to get into that club are basically your um, body fat, so you are body fat, and then the people coming along that jump the queue and they get in first is basically the alcohol calories. So effectively, what that does, your body, because alcohol is a toxin, it wants to get rid of the alcohol. So it's gonna prioritize burning alcohol before it even burns your, your body fat. So that's how it stops body fat dead. So for example, if you have um, three beers um, and they are three units, that's gonna take you around about nine hours to burn it off. I know obviously some people they go out, they have a lot more um, and there's shots involved and, and so forth. So if you've had a heavy night, that could potentially set you back and stop you burning body fat for a good couple of days. So if you're out on a Saturday night, you might not start burning body fat until sort of Tuesday. Um, so it's just to make you aware, it's not to scare you, it's just to make you aware how alcohol um, plays a part in body fat loss. 
So it's just a, a guidance really. At the end of the day, the way I say and what I say to all my clients is you get out what you put in. If you want to get to your goals and you want to drop body fat um, in, in a timely fashion, then obviously you just got to look at your alcohol intake and, and what you do basically. And like I say, the calories is effectively empty calories in alcohol. So you don't, there's no nutrition value um, from it. So it's obviously not good for you. Um, but it does stop body fat loss. Your body will prioritise calories in the alcohol before it starts burning your body fat. So you're putting a, a block on it, basically. Um, so that is it, what I wanted to, to share with you guys. Hopefully you took some value from it. One other point as well, with alcohol, um, I, I spoke to someone the other day, um, just quickly touching on this. Um, and they say roughly they might have about four or five pints um, within a couple of hours, three hours or so. Um, so effectively, that, that is the equivalent to around about two and a half litres. So where I'm going with this is he struggles to drink water. So the ideal recommended is two and a half litres to three litres of water a day. Um, helps flush out all your toxins and everything like that and keeps you hydrated. So I said to him, if, if you can sink five beers, um, which is around about two and a half litres within three hours, how can you not sink two and a half litres of water within a day, say 10, 12 hours? Um, so it got him thinking, um, and it, it got him thinking in terms of his, his mentality. So now he's going to go away um, and hopefully drink, drink his um, guidance of, of water, maybe cut back on the the beer side of things because he does want to shift um, body fat. So hopefully um, he can do that. So I said five minutes, I think it's just gonna come up to about seven minutes, but I do hope there's um, been some added value for you guys um, and a little bit of, of education around about alcohol versus body fat. Um, I'm gonna be posting more videos, more educational videos and more added value videos um, as the weeks and months go on. Um, so stay tuned, um, check out my like page, The Wellness Suite, where all the um, videos will be held. Um, but have a great day, guys, and I'll catch you soon. Take it easy.